all right people what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video for today and ooh, buddy man it's been two days since christmas and we're still getting gifts this is a brand new trailer for the batman which i cannot wait for it comes out march march 4th i want to say is that right or 11th is it fourth or 11th? it's one of those days or maybe watch it's gonna be the 18th or something uh i am super excited for this movie uh we get a new trailer uh this one's called the bat and the cat that's right, it has a, has a name, uh, which reminds me of uh, the marketing for Batman Returns. Anybody remember that? Where it was the bat, the cat, the penguin. It was good stuff. Um, and the penguin's in this too, so you can actually replicate that marketing if you want. Uh, add the Riddler in there too. Uh, and supposedly there's a rumor that the Joker's going to be in this, and it's going to be played by uh, the, uh, oh, what's his name? Barry, K I don't know how to pronounce his name. Is it Coogan? 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 Whatever. He was in the Eternals movie. Uh, he's been in a lot of really good movies, too. Green Knight he was in. He had a really small role, but he was really good in it. Killing of a Sacred Deer, shout-outs. He was in Dunkirk. Anyway, uh, so excited for this movie. Let's go. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Three. All right, hold on. I need to get, <clears throat> I need to get prepared. Oh, oh, all right, now, okay, let's go. Three, two, one, play. Good start. Good start. Great start. Sorry. I wouldn't be bothering you here, but your people keep telling me you're unavailable. You look familiar. <laughs> His face. You, know, you really right. could be doing more for this city. The family has a history of philanthropy, oh, but as far as I can tell, you're not doing anything. That part's gonna be so awesome. Gee, I want a good ass car chase. I haven't seen a good car chase in so long, it feels like. Yo, he's nothing but goo. How's he alive? The Riddler. He's asking for you. The killer left this for the Batman. Why is he writing to you? It's me. That's creepy as fuck. All about the Waynes. If we don't stand up, no one will. Okay. I have a thing about strays. The bat and the cat. Oh, hey. Okay. New friend of yours. Mmm. Sausage. Sure. I'm just here to unmask the truth about this cesspool we call a city. You're part of this, too. I love that voice. Oh, no, my part of this. For real, there. Oh, you're really not as smart as I thought you were. I love his voice. Way. Okay. Unsurprisingly, he knows who he is. No. We all have our scars, Bruce. He's still away. He's involved in this. Oh, he's not involved. How do you know? He's up with Delaney. Who are you under there? What are you hiding? Selena, don't throw your life away. Don't worry, honey. I got nine of them. <laughs> Can be cruel, poetic, or blind. This looks so fucking good. It's your violence you may find. Justice. The answer's justice. Yeah, it's all riddled. Come on, vengeance. You better find one riddler trophy. Oh, no, he's got the makeup stall. Oh my god. Yo, back to back. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> March 4th. Yo. <laughs> we look so good. You know what? I love his voice too, I should say. Like I would I, I was I was liking what I was hearing, but that last trailer, there was a couple times where I'm just like it sounded a little weird to me. That was like my only complaint with that last trailer. It was such a minor complaint that I, I didn't even bring it up in the uh, trailer reaction. But um it was such a minor one. That's like the only thing. Like when he punches that uh, window, it's like, what have you done? Like I understood what he said, but I saw other people reacting to it going like, what did you just say? It's like, it was pretty clear to me, but I guess maybe it's, I was also one of those guys when watching the uh, Nolan movies, I, I totally understood everything Christian Bell's Batman said. I never understood why people couldn't understand what he said. Um, I get the meme of just not knowing what he's saying, but there's times where I'm just like, it's very clear what he's saying in those Nolan movies. I don't know. Uh, maybe I, I just understood. I just understand Batman more. 
No, I never read comics. Um, I, mean, I do wish, like, in the comics, though, whenever he's talking as Batman, like, the the words are less legible. <laughs> like, you can't, like, what the, f <laughs> I can't, what is this saying? Oh, he's talking as Batman, I get it. Because he's doing his gravel voice. Um, <laughs> in the comics, I know he doesn't do a gravel voice. But anyway, uh, that was a great trailer. Yeah. I want to go back to that. At least that action scene. Justice. Justice. The answer's justice. The answer's justice. So I love that he's actually going to have to solve some Riddler uh, uh, riddles. Come on, vengeance. Oh, that's such a good shot. Let's get into some trouble. I think their relationship's going to be really fun. There you go. Oh, man. That role was so Batman Arkham. Bam. Bat. Oh, my God. So good. And then his turn. <laughs> it looks so good. God damn. Oh, wait. Hold on. What does that say at the bottom? Is that Riddler shit? Yo, Riddler tagged the, the title. Look. Look at this stuff. That's kind of fun. Right there. I'm sure someone's already uh, deciphered it, even though it's all, the trailer's been out for like 40 minutes at this point. Uh, uh, I, I kind of want to watch this one more time. Him rolling in. <laughs> bop, bop. He needs to do one jump roll, like uh, Arkham Asylum Batman would do, where he just like he jumps and does that, and then he like punches or kicks. I want to play Arkham games now. You know what? I think I might play Arkham City again right before this comes out. Because the last trailer that came out made me really want to play Arkham Origins. Um, and I played a little bit of it, and it was really good. But, like, Arkham City is my shit. And Arkham Asylum. Those are my two favorite. Two two of my favorite games, period, of all time. Bat. Whoop. Yeah. Bat. And Batman. So good. God, and you know what's going to be really fucking great is this car chase right here. This one right here where he has to chase down Penguin. Where is it? I guess it was earlier. Yeah, it was earlier. As far as I can tell, you're not doing anything. He's like, oh. Where is that? It's coming back. But, well, I want to see this roll he, this car does. Let's see, like, all right, let's see. Dead, dead, dead. <laughs> yeah, seatbelt. Oh, he's fine. You can survive anything as long as you have your seatbelt on. Well, for this city. Let's see this beginning. Wait, he's about to crash into that thing. I don't know. It was before. I'm always Bottom terrible at that. Here, but your people keep telling me you're unavailable. He's like, oh, shit. <laughs> I love that. I love the look of the Batmobile, too. It's just, it just looks like a car. And you know what I really appreciate about this is that it's going more realistic, obviously. But not too realistic. It still has some silly shit in it. Um, if you really think about it, uh, I mean, not silly, like overly, like that's a great shot right there. Um, not overly, but like, look, not him, getting a, him getting a, him getting a question mark in his coffee. Um, some silly stuff, I guess you could say like, um, I guess him fighting all those dudes too. I mean, he's, he's a, he's a change for Gotham change, 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 change. change. Involved. Oh, he's not involved. How do you know? Yeah, I'm gonna watch this trailer again. Maybe I should just watch it again. <laughs> it's, I should stop watching trailers that I really love over and over again. Because that usually backfires. Reason why is because I go to a movie theater and then I have to see the trailer like another three dozen times before a movie comes out. That's what happened with Matrix. I'm like, oh, cool. I'll watch it a few times and then I go to the theater for every movie in front of it was the Matrix trailer. But then sometimes that backfires my my thinking, and then I I'm like, oh yeah, Spider Man trailer was awesome. I can't wait to see that in theater. I never saw the Spider Man trailer in my theater. I don't know why. I guess it was just they didn't need to advertise it. I guess that is their thought process. Like yeah, people are gonna see it. Who gives a shit. Show Matrix. People aren't gonna see that. Which I guess they were true. I mean they're right. They were true. Where it all began. Is that the alleyway? And what what is Alfred lying about? Andy Circus, director of Venom. I, I do like his voice actually i mean they're going back to the gravelly voice but it sounds good i think i'm okay with that she looks great I mean, I, when i heard she was cast i was like that's a that's a good choice so i'm glad she ended up being good i haven't really seen her in a movie where i, I thought she's great though um 
uh, Zoe Kravitz. Like, she's, she's been good in a lot, but I don't think she's ever had a real, like, role that can she could sink her teeth into. Uh, the only movie I could think of where I thought she was really good in was uh, Mad Max Fury Road. Though. <laughs> that's the only one I could think of, though. So, that's the Batman. Uh, the Bat and the Cat trailer. Good stuff. Anyway, there we go. That's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. Till next time, we'll see you guys later. Goodbye.